A very pleasant morning to one and all. Today we shall look at a very important topic in English grammar. Proper and common nouns. Before we look at them, children, can you tell me what do you mean by nouns? Nouns are names of persons, places, animals and things. Wonderful dear! You are exactly right. Nouns are names of persons, places, animals and things. Do you know? Nouns are also known as naming words. There are different types of nouns and today we shall look at two of them. Common nouns and proper nouns. Now what is meant by common nouns? The general name given to a person, place, animal or a thing is known as a common noun. Let's try to understand the concept with a few examples. In this sentence, he is my brother. About whom am I talking? We are talking about brother. So brother is a general name given to a person. In the second sentence, I live in a city. About what am I discussing here? We are discussing about a city. So city is a general name for a place. In the third sentence, I have a pet dog. What am I talking about? We are talking about a dog. So dog is a general name given to an animal. In the fourth sentence, we have a beautiful car. What are we discussing here? We are discussing about a car. So car is a general name for a thing. So here we have seen the general names given to a person, animal, place and a thing. These general names that are brother, dog, city, car are known as common nouns. Dear children, we should remember that when we use common nouns, we have to write it down in small letters. Common nouns are not capitalized unless they begin with a sentence or are a part of a title. Now let's look at a second type of noun. That is proper noun. What is meant by a proper noun? The special name given to a person, place, animal or a thing is known as a proper noun. Children, just recapitulate. General name is known as common noun and special name is known as proper noun. Let's try to find out the proper nouns or the special names in the following sentences. In this sentence, my brother is Arjun. Which is a special noun used? Arjun is the special name for brother. In the second sentence, I live in Delhi. Which is a special name used here? Delhi is the special name for the city. In the third sentence, the name of my pet is Jimmy. Which special name have I used? Jimmy is the special name for the pet. In the next sentence, we have bought a Honda City. Which is a special name used? Honda City is the special name for the car. So dear children, remember. When we use a proper noun, it has to begin with a capital letter. The proper noun may appear at the beginning of a sentence or even in the middle of a sentence. 
No matter whether proper nouns appear in a sentence, it should always begin with a capital letter. So here we have seen the special names used for a person, animal, place and a thing. These special names Arjun, Jimmy, Delhi, Honda City are known as proper nouns. Besides persons, places, animals and things, special names are also used for rivers, mountains, days of the week, months of the year, books, festivals, monuments, countries. Hence, we can say that the special names that are given to monuments, days of the week, months of the year, rivers, mountains, festivals, books, etc. are known as proper nouns. Now let's look at some more examples. Girl, common noun. Tina Proper noun Country Common noun India Proper noun Mountain Common noun Himalayas Proper noun Monument Common noun Taj Mahal Proper noun Festival Common noun Honor Proper noun Cartoon Common noun Common noun Mumbai Proper noun Book Common noun Cinderella Proper noun River Common noun Ganga, proper noun. So, what did we see? Let's recap that. Common nouns are general names, whereas proper nouns are special names. All these names are given to a person, place, animal, or a thing. All the proper nouns always begin with a capital letter. I hope everyone has understood the concept of proper and common noun. Thank you all for watching this video.